What's up guys, so I'm going to show you how to play Fortnite split screen on PS5 so that you can play Fortnite on two accounts, super easy and fast. But real quick, I would like to let you guys know that I do give my subscribers free skins and whatever they do want from the Fortnite item shop, including the battle pass. So if you would like the chance to get a free gift from me in Fortnite, just subscribe with the notifications, like the video, and then leave a comment with your Epic Games username so I can add you guys on Fortnite and send you a free gift. And if you would like to support the channel, consider using support a creator code YAF inside of the item shop hashtag ad. But now guys, let's go ahead and get into how to split screen on PS5, the easiest and the fastest way possible. And I'm gonna be showing you guys every single step you need to do, and this will 100% guarantee it works for you guys. So the first thing you guys are going to want to go ahead and do in order to split screen on PS5 so that you can play on two accounts is make your way to the home menu of your PlayStation 5 exactly like how I've just done right here right now guys. Now once you've made your way to your home menu you guys are going to want to go ahead and go to the settings icon in the top right. And then once you guys have gone to the settings icon, this is really simple and really, really easy of what you're going to want to do in order to split screen, guys. So you guys, once you are in the settings, okay, you're going to scroll down until you find accessories right here. Once you guys are on accessories, you guys are going to go ahead and click on general. And then you'll see all these different options here where you'll then want to go ahead and basically go to Bluetooth accessories. Once you guys have done that, you guys just need to double check that you've got both of the wireless controllers or if they're wired, connected via the Bluetooth accessory. So what you guys need to do is plug in a cable on a brand new controller and then connect it that way to your PlayStation or hold the on button and then the little button in the top left corner with like the three dashes. If you guys are looking at your PlayStation controller right now, you'll know what I mean. You hold that and the little button, okay, on the left, like the, the small button on the left of your PS5 controller at the same time for like five seconds, it will flash blue and then it will appear here and then you guys need to connect it. It should say it's accessories found, but once you've done that, make sure that both of your controllers are connected and then also make sure you've got two accounts and they both have PlayStation Plus on them. So they both need PlayStation Plus. Okay, and then once you guys have actually done these steps, we're going to go ahead and head back into Fortnite, just like so. And then we're going to go ahead and to in order to play PS5 split screen on Fortnite, we're going to open up the pools menu. All right, guys. And once we've opened up the pools menu, you guys are going to see like your name. You're going to see social add friends, looking for party, voice chat, menu, all these different options, right? And in order to play Fortnite split screen on PS5, we're going to go to menu where you'll see settings, parental controls, reporting, support and refunds, and legal. We're going to go ahead and go into the settings. And then once we've gone to the settings, go all the way over. I'm not sure why colorblind mode is on. Go all the way over to the right tab where it does say account and privacy. So once you guys are on account and privacy, in order to split screen on your PS5 and Fortnite, you guys are going to scroll down past account, past the um, clip in, go underneath here. Okay, you guys, and then you guys are going to want your party join ability on invite only just for the time being because if anyone joins when you're first trying to split screen it will mess it up obviously people can join after but when you're first split screening put it on invite only because if anyone joins then it's going to be super super annoying next up you want your friend invite permission okay this can actually go ahead and be friends of friends and then once you guys have done that as well in order to make sure the split screen works put hidden matchmaking delay on zero seconds guys if you have this on more than zero seconds it can mess up the delay because if one account on your fortnite which you're split screening on has this like turned on to like 10 seconds and the other zero you're not going to match making at the same time and it's going to kick you out the game so make sure this is zero seconds once you've done all of these steps guys 
okay every single one of these steps and you've basically connected your controller so i'm going to take my second controller now okay and i'm going to go ahead and hold the button all right so now you can see i'm signed into another account in the top right and i'm in fortnite okay and basically which i now know the device is actually on which is honestly crazy okay so you guys can actually pretty much see like if it's all working and all that and in order to split screen in fortnite guys we're nearly on the final step to split screen on ps5 in fortnite guys this works on ps5 which is honestly amazing i know a lot of people have issues with split screen so i'm going to show you guys exactly now how to do it so once you've done all of these steps guys for the final final step you guys are going to make your way back inside of the fortnite battle royale main lobby just exactly where i am right here right now guys now once you have made your way back inside the battle royale main lobby you're going to want to make sure both controllers are ready they're both full of battery or they're plugged in and you've paired it and then once you've done that inside of the ps5 settings and the fortnite settings guys you, you're gonna see in the battle royale lobby it says login you, you guys see that in the bottom right you guys are gonna get your new controller and then press login and it's gonna log in a brand new player It'll say player two this is what it should look like once you guys are split screening okay so it's gonna say player two it's gonna all work and all that but we're not done yet what i'd recommend you do is make sure you add the friend um as a split screen so make sure you add epic friend okay so you guys have to add the epic friend sent from request as you can see and then basically go on the other account and accept it if you can and then it will just work a lot more smooth now you guys can see in the bottom it says take control hold so if you guys want to take control using your second account i'm going to take control now and you can see i'm now on the other one so i can access the item shop my locker the battle pass but you can't ready up unless it's the main host so look there we go i've accepted the friend request that makes everything easier and then if you want to switch back guys just hold on the other controller and then in order to split screen for the final step if you want to play duo squads literally just both ready up and uh yeah that will basically do it for you so that is how you split screen inside of fortnite on ps5 that is the full guide guys let me know down below in the comment section um if you guys found this guide useful this is literally all the steps you need to do and yeah guys that's basically the video share the video with everyone you know go down below drop a like and subscribe to the channel with a post notification bell turn on i'll catch you guys in the next one peace